One of the things people ask me when we're talking about cPanel versus our managed WordPress product is, what's the big deal, right? Like, if I'm using WordPress on cPanel, why would I want to move off of cPanel to use WordPress in the managed environment? And my general response, at least on the side of performance, is to ask the question, right? What do you know and what are you testing when it comes to the version of PHP that you're using? Or what do you know uh, when it comes to the plugins that you should be thinking about and using for performance? Are, are you looking at and are you an expert in evaluating the various different caching plugins, for example, that exist out there? If you are an expert, then you can do anything that we're doing on the managed platform, you can do it yourself on cPanel. If you know which plugins are best for in queuing outbound JavaScript calls or which are the best for managing the calls that are coming in to give you caching performance enhancements, then pick, right? Pick the, pick the plugin you want. For people who don't know, what we offer in the managed environment is our assessment, our evaluation of a whole bunch of different caching plugins, for example, a whole bunch of performance enhancing scripts and comparing them and evaluating them against the platform to figure out what are the best ones. So that when we make a recommendation for lazy loading images or lazy loading comments or how we manage JavaScript or CSS files, when we make that recommendation, not only do we know that it's high performing on our stack, we also know of all the ones out there, these are the ones we're gonna recommend. If you have 10, 15 years of experience working with WordPress, you know how to evaluate the code, you can totally run cPanel on your own and you can do anything you want on your own. But when it comes to performance, more often than not, if you're not that expert, you're gonna wanna go with our managed WordPress offering.